In this video you will learn how to become a notary loan signing agent in Alabama. The steps outlined in this video will show you how to become a notary loan signing agent in Alabama. Step 1. Meet the basic requirements. Your first step to become a notary loan signing agent in Alabama is that you will need to meet the state requirements. These are as follows. You must possess all legal requirements to be an officer in the state. You must be at least age 18. You must be a resident of Alabama and the county of application. You cannot have a felony conviction unless a pardon restores your civil and political rights. Step 2. Take a loan signing agent course. This next step to become an Alabama notary loan signing agent is not mandatory but it's highly encouraged. You should consider taking a course that will teach you how to actually make money as a notary signing agent in Alabama. We have listed the top notary signing agent training course below this video. Step 3. Complete the Alabama notary training and exam. The next step to become a notary signing agent in Alabama is that you may need to take an Alabama notary exam. It seems that not all counties require you to take the exam since it is at the discretion of the appointing county probate judge. You will need to find out who the probate judge is in your county and contact him to verify. You can find out the probate judge in your county on the Alabama Secretary of State website. We have placed a link to the page to find your probate judge below this video. Step 4 purchase a surety bond. The next step on your journey to become a notary loan signing agent in Alabama is that you will need to obtain a surety bond. A $25,000 surety bond with a four years term is required by the Alabama Secretary of State. To get this surety bond be sure you get it from a licensed surety such as a notary bonding company, an insurance company, or a notary organization. Remember, the surety bond is not meant to protect you as the notary but it protects those for whom you perform a notarization. For your protection, you may get errors and omissions insurance. Step 5. Submit your notary commission application. The next step to become a notary signing agent in Alabama is that you will need to submit your notary commission application to the probate judge. You will apply at the office of the probate judge in your county of residence since probate judges are responsible for appointing and commissioning notaries. Applications are available on many of the county websites. Bring your completed application to the probate judge in your county. Be sure to bring the surety bond you purchased. There will be an application fee and this cost will vary depending on the county. Your commission will be sent to the Alabama Secretary of State because they maintain records of all notaries public in Alabama. Step 6. Review the Notary Commission Certificate. When your application has been approved, you get a notary commission there is a fee of $10. Make sure to check the commission certificate to ensure that all the details are correct. Step 7. Get a notary seal. The next step to become an Alabama notary loan signing agent is that you will need to get a notary seal. This is required to have a loan signing business in Alabama. You can get this seal from most office supply stores. It must comply with all Alabama regulatory rules. It can either be an ink stamp or metal embosser. It does not have to be an embosser. You will have to always keep the notary seal in a locked and secured area. Step 8. Keep a notary journal. Alabama no longer requires notaries to keep a journal of notarial acts. However, keeping a notary journal to record all of your notary acts is really a good practice to keep and part of running a good business. This journal can help to provide proof that you have taken reasonable steps to identify the signer of a document. That is why many notaries would keep a notary journal. If you will use a journal, it's suggested to get one with pre-printed pages and that's bounded. You can typically find these at office supply stores or through notary associations. Note, the information in this video is subject to change. Check with your state to verify current requirements. Don't forget to like our video. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel.